All right, let's make a website. So I am logged into my Bluehost back end, the admin panel called the C panel um, for control panel. And what we're going to do is install WordPress. So one click install, it says. And now wait. So all you do is click this get started and they change this around like where the get started button is, but you'll just have to find it. So we're going to select the domain and this one's going to be break up with your boss. So if you only have one domain purchased, obviously only one will show up. I'm kind of a collector of domain names. Um, so I have a bunch. Anyway, as your install is ready to begin, click next to continue. So this is where we see the, the progress of what's going to happen. And this is um, the login details that you'll need later. So I'm going to go ahead and I understand. I have read. We're going to start a new Word document to save these passwords. So copy. Break up with your boss. This. You can change this later um, if you'd like it to be something that you can remember. I usually do. So I'm going to save this document to my computer. So that oh, wrong one. Let's just go to remaster clients, Chris and Vicky. and save it. Okay. Now click install and it's going to do its deal. This can take anywhere between like one to five minutes. Just depends on, I'll kind of let you know right here what the progress is. So I'm going to go ahead and just pause this until it is installed. Okay. So now this says installation complete. Continue browsing the marketplace or view credentials here. So this is the marketplace they're talking about. I don't buy anything from them. I already have a theme and everything that's already paid for, that I use for virtually all of my um, website builds. But you, if you didn't copy and paste your um, username and password and all that kind of stuff, it's all right here. So this is your login link to be able to log in to your, um, post, to your website so we can start building. Let me go ahead and click over there. I'm going to enter in this username and password. Logging in. There it goes. I'm save that password. I'm not going to save it in LastPass. And the client is online. So all this, we don't need help. We're going to do it ourselves. So this, to let you know, this is what it looked like before we installed WordPress. And this is what it looks like now. We're not going to use any of this stuff. All right. So I'll see you on the next video.